Hello, wonderful humans. I want to talk to you today about how to copy a progress tracking form for a bunch of your people. So what I did when I was creating a, I'm just like, I'm make sure I'm sharing the right thing. Um, but when I was creating forms for everyone in my group, what I did is like, for example, round four is actually should say blank. Please, yeah, sorry. It's like, but I had, I put someone's name, I, I would just have it blank. And then I have one, just one original. And then I have the weeks. And I just learned, by the way, I was like very, I mean, I'm like not mad about it, but I was kind of like, really? If you just go and you have the dates, you can literally just copy and paste. Yeah, this is. I, I hand put every single date in. You can literally just copy and paste all the dates. So awesome. So that's what you do. You go in and you make that. And then once you've got it for one person, so you say, what week is it? And um, if you don't know which, if you don't know, the exact week it is or things like that, um, what you can do is you can just have it as a blank space and they just type it in and it will populate when they have the spreadsheet. So it'll say when, which response came in when, so you don't need to do like what week it, is it necessarily. You could just say, put today's date, five wins of the week, breakthrough of the week, where you're going to implement, how much money, and then marketing, sales, managing leads, planning, and overall organization. You might have different forms and things like that, but that is what it would look like. And then for the responses, you link it to a sheet, create, and then it has that spreadsheet. And I think I have a separate video going over that. But if you want to make a copy of all these lovely humans that are getting support from you, what you want to do here is for each person, what I did is I said, make a copy. It takes like two seconds. It was like very quick. And I clicked here and I said, Megs, Megs. Create. And then within the classroom, That's what the timestamp is the, for the mastermind. If I wanted to create material, what I do is I would say mix. And then I don't have students in this classroom yet because it is not open, but I would make sure I got Megs's form, send, send, put the link here, copy it, and then say form. Here, spreadsheet. And then I made it so that everyone could edit there. So you can click here, share. Anyone with the link can edit. Because I want people, if they wanted to go back and check their um, their funds or things like that, they could. And that would be here. And I would post it. And I would put it under progress tracking. And if you wanted to be like only one person can see it, you can change it so that one person can see it. Like for instance, you no one sees all this, but for here, if you click four, you can choose which student it's for. So I hope that was helpful. I love you guys dearly. Keep up the good work and I will see you soon.